Fireworks were originally created for the purpose of entertainment, and today they are still widely used in celebration to mark special occasions since they were invented by the Chinese almost a thousand years ago. The thrill and excitement generated by fireworks brightening the night sky and immersing it with vivid displays of color and technicality which makes them a crowd pleaser. But have you ever wondered how they work? The sights and sounds of each explosion are the result of several chemical reactions, oxidations and reductions taking place within the firework as it ascends into the sky. Colors in fireworks are usually generated by things called stars, which produce intense light when ignited. Stars contain five basic types of ingredients. An oxidizer, a compound that produces oxygen to support the combustion of the fuel. The most commonly used oxidizers are nitrates, chlorates, and perchlorates. A fuel, which allows the star to burn. Firework fuel is usually charcoal, which is carbon, and sulfur. The reducing agent is the fuel used to burn the oxygen produced by the oxidizers. It combines with the oxygen from the oxidizers to produce the energy of the explosion. A binder. Binders hold the mixture together. The binder is usually sugar, starch, or shellac. Color producing chemicals. Different metals produce different colors. Red is strontium. Orange is calcium, calcium salts usually. Uh, electric whites like magnesium or aluminum or something like that. Um, blue, that was pretty good one. Blue is usually copper. Green is barium. Yellow is sodium compounds. Gold is some type of iron, usually with some kind of potash or some kind of carbon in it. Purple is a combination of strontium and copper, so you got the red and the blue going together. The colored sparkles explode and float down the darkened sky, thrilling everyone watching below. Fireworks have been a familiar part of celebrations for centuries, and for most of that time, the designing of fireworks was a craft. Only recently have people begun to try and understand the science involved in creating the spectacular fireworks displays we all enjoy. So, without science and without chemistry, we wouldn't have gotten the spectacular form of entertainment and amusement that we enjoy from time to time in celebrations.